So starting with Windows XP Media Center Edition, Microsoft started including some pretty nice Media Center software in their operating systems. Um, this became more prevalent with Vista, and now with Windows 7, it's actually really nice. You can record TV, watch your movies, listen to music. But the problem is, how do you get that to your TV? One way is with your Xbox 360 as a media extender. So load up your Xbox 360 and navigate over to the Windows Media Center icon and select that. This screen just tells you a little bit about the process, so just click continue on here to go on to the next screen. And what's going to happen is it's going to generate a code for you. You need this code to take to your PC and put that in Media Center on your PC to make the link between the 360 and your Media Center. So let's do that. Alright, so here I've loaded up Windows Media Center and we're just on the task menu in the settings. And we're going to navigate over to the Media Center Add Extender option. In here, again, this gives you a little splash screen and tells you about the process. Just click Next on this uh, first screen to bypass this. And when you hit Next, it's going to ask you for that code that it generated in on the Xbox 360. Now this code is different than the one on the previous screen because I did this in two shots, but you just take that code, enter it in here, and hit the Next button. Now what happens here is it starts configuring, and you can see up in the right hand corner I put a shot of what it looks like on the TV. So you can kind of see what's happening on the PC and what's happening on the TV at the same time. And for the interest of time, I'm going to go ahead and speed up this process a little bit, uh, just so you don't have to watch. So I'm going to uh, do this in fast forward until we get to the end of the process. Okay, so here we are in fast forward, and as you watch the process, you'll see that it searches for the media extender, and then it configures it, and then it starts building the library. And right around that time, you'll see the TV start to go through its process of connecting to the PC, and then you'll get the Media Center splash screen, and then uh, you'll get the main menu. So let's take a look at that. All right, so here we are, all done with the process. Everything is connected now. Um, going through some of these menus here, you can see that the media library is still being built. So there's not a lot of media items yet. If you go into music, it's the same deal. Um, you know, that the library is still being built. There's a couple of things in there. The photos, it seems, are usually the, the first thing to be built. So um, there's a couple items in here, but you can just go into your library and navigate through your files, select one, and uh, display it. So that about wraps it up. That's about all there is to connecting your Xbox 360 to your media center, um, me making an extender. This way you can hook it up in your living room or your, your office or wherever you want to watch your media that's on your uh, media center. Uh, hopefully you found this tutorial useful. If you did, please go ahead and uh, rate and subscribe and visit our website, learnfilms.com, for more tutorials and reviews. Uh, if you have any suggestions, just go ahead and shoot us a, a request, and we'll see if we can make the video for you. Thanks for watching.